Wow, Beetle Bailey has serious PTSD. Oh, hey there. This time on Video Vulture, we'll be looking at the ridiculous spy comedy, Mad Mission 3, Our Man from Bond Street. So, let's check it out, shall we? This is Video Vulture. Welcome to Video Vulture. I'm your host, John Tebbett. With me, as always, is Tom Bagley and Cody Cook, who has not seen today's movie. No. <laughs> this will be... First for me, so yeah, yeah. Yeah, usually entirely new experience. Yeah. Yeah, usually we show you ahead of time. This one's gonna take you completely by surprise. Yes. I think it will take him by surprise. What do you think, Tom? This is a few surprising elements of this yeah, movie. Yeah, <laughs> it's kind of the, one of those buddy comedies which yeah. It is, it's yeah. A, it's an action hit and miss, but it's so there's a lot of hits, so it's yeah. <laughs> the movie we're talking about is Mad Mission Three, Our Man from Bond Street, uh, made in Hong Kong. The Mad Mission series is a popular series of Hong Kong action comedies. Kind of along the lines of the Pink Panther, a lot of uh, goofiness and wackiness. I, Try and imagine a Pink Panther movie made by Jackie Chan. That's approximately yeah, where we're a little going. bit, yeah. Good, that has that feel. What were yeah. they called originally in uh, Hong Kong? Aces Go Places. Yeah. Uh, so if you look it up, it's Aces Go Places. That seems to be the, the very common that shows up. Yeah, yeah. Place. Although you can find it as Mad Mission on IMDb. Yeah. Uh, the basics of what happened so far is that we have an international jewel thief, uh, Sam, played by Samuel Hui, who's a stuntman in real life. He's, he's one of these lovable rogue characters who's... Uh, who's basically on the wrong side of the law, but is good-hearted and you root for him and at the end he's reformed. Uh, the two police officers on his tail are played by Sylvia Chang as Hot Tongue, that's her character's name, and uh, the bald cop named Cody Jack, played by uh, movie's producer Carl Macca. Uh, a little fight scene here. This is only in the dub version, this little bit here. With the, uh... This fight scene? Yeah. Do they reshoot uh, it then? You're lucky. They, it's a completely different edit from Aces Go Places. Hey, what are you doing there? They were fighting. In Paris, we do not fight, we make love. Ah! Hey, thanks. <laughs> yeah, that gag's not in the international version. That's so weird. Instead, they cut straight to the appearance of a classic Bond villain. Get ready for this. And it's Odd Job, ladies and gentlemen. Odd Job, look like. Yes, yeah, the real Harold Sakata died in 1982, right when they were making their first Mad Mission movie. So is this odd job character in all three of the movies, or just no, this? no? This, this one's is really Bond focused. Okay. So there, there's a okay. Speaking of Bond, look who we have. Oh wow! Yes, um, Richard Keel. Yep, Jaws himself, the real Richard Keel, playing, playing another uh, Bond type supervillain, dressed to the nines, looking very dapper. That's great. Yep, that's a big suit. Oh yeah, over seven feet. Uh, like it really stood out. And uh, really wacky clown-like performance from Richard Keel here. I, I get the idea that he recognized that he wasn't going to have a lot of dialogue. What words he did have would be dubbed. Yeah. So he's really hamming it up here. <laughs> he's, he's those the uh, clown-like reactions. <laughs> this is the kind of broad humor that we're going through in, in this entire series. That's it's really like of Python. And more like uh, Warner Brothers okay. cartoons. <laughs> Very really into it. Here we are. Odd does again and has a bionic hand for some reason. And this is a nice touch where the evil henchmen are actually wearing protective. Uh, they're wearing parachutes in the event that they get thrown off the Eiffel Tower. That's smart. Except that we can do that. <laughs> Oh man, do they have a parachute fight? You know it, man. Parachute battle. Wow. <laughs> Is that how you use a parachute? I would think so. <laughs> what I would do. Yeah. Well, you do that. You cut off your parachute, throw it in his face, and then dive underwater. Especially if you have a secret breathing device. He's Batman. He's totally Batman. <laughs> yeah, after all it's gone so far, you pretty much have to end with a giant robot shark. That's, you know, quick, off with your shoes. Why? So that can happen. Nice. Does it help? It does not. It helps speed the film along. So. Yeah. Yeah. Gives you a scene where you get to put shoes on your hands. I will point out Mad Mission 3 does have a bunch of celebrity impersonators, starting with. Uh, Classic Sean Connery guy here. Who are you? Special agent to Her Majesty the Queen. No need to mention my number, you know what it is. Well, he 
he's low rent Sean Connery impressionist who doesn't look like him at all when you first see him and just doesn't sound like him. You have a few moments where you go, oh yeah, I can kind of see him being Sean Connery. That's about as far as it goes. It's also a Queen Elizabeth impersonator hiding in the portrait in the back. I'm pretty fast, you know. No speed and no brains. It's quite useless. Oh, nice. That was yeah. a good gag. Yeah, yeah, there's lots of fake outs like that. So, into the laser. Yeah, right. let's get Which on. Is kind of a troll pay. Yeah, let's get on with the obligatory jewel theft sequence. Always a highlight. Here he's wrapped himself in a hot pocket so he can cross the laser grid. First, he has to defeat this fiendish security device. Let's see. Oh, it's tic tac toe. <laughs> it is. Yeah, what are you gonna do? There's no way to defeat Tic Tac Toe, it's always a tie. Yeah. Ah! Unless. <laughs> so he just knew to bring this extra spray. Oh, wouldn't you? <laughs> That's the only way to win Tic Tac Toe. I guess, yeah. <laughs> Otherwise, it's a tie. Here's your skateboarding, Cody. Oh my. And of course, they leave a big plume of smoke so they know how to find yeah, you. Yeah, exactly where to trail them. Well, they didn't have the emission standards on skateboards. Yeah. Get no, back at this no. point. Yeah. So, especially in Hong Kong. Oh, yeah. <laughs> None of these complaints matter if you're a little kid watching this movie, it's just awesome. <laughs> so there's just a, a half pipe right in the middle of the street there? Yeah. Really, Cody? That's the thing that you don't think is realistic about this movie? <laughs> Tic-tac-toe, sure, yeah, that's fine. Rocket sled, but oh, come on, there's a half pipe on the street. <laughs> How dare you? <laughs> Where's my suspension of disbelief, yeah. right? You've changed, man. Yeah. <laughs> So according to this film, there are two crown jewels, so it's time to steal the second one. Like the legitimate jetpacks from Thunderball. That were... <laughs> Looks like the legitimate Santas, too. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah, they're very convincing. <laughs> Which is why the kids are on their side. Yeah. Over, yeah. Yay, you're gonna Santa. <laughs> Santas. Robbers disguised as Santa Clauses. They're heading your way. Well, what's the next best thing? If you don't have jetpacks for your Santas, you gotta have something else, right? Some other yeah, means what could to, it be? Some other, uh... <laughs> <laughs> Means of transport. Yeah, some dirt trans bikes. Yeah, nice. <laughs> some good ramp riding there. Yeah, that's a good um, stunt. Precision vehicle chases are a staple of the series. Yeah, and nobody actually shooting their guns. No, right? they just kind of yeah. Like, yeah, they just Get like em, stop them. Yeah, They're just yell at them really loud. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So changing from jetpacks to motorcycles just because? Just so you can do that. Just oh, like, yeah. <laughs> but you couldn't have done that with the jetpack. <laughs> I guess they weren't as precise. Maybe the as aim, oh, yeah, yeah, better yeah. Nothing works for you, Cody. The half pipes, <laughs> the motorbike Santas. It's just so not believable. You're having trouble suspending your disbelief yeah, with this yeah. movie, aren't you? You're a tough although customer this, this time. Yeah, yeah although yeah, this yeah. scene is a little bit like realistic and gritty by comparison. Let's check this out. Ooh. Oh yeah, quite the change in tone. Yeah, a little bit. Yeah, it's a little dark. <laughs> there you are. Go ahead, take it. Thank you for watching Video Vulture. Tom, you want to play us out? Why, sure. All right. Thanks a lot.